um, speak about my feelings more, right? Maybe I need to not get upset with them if they refuse to talk to me because they're breaking down, right? Figure out what it is and then work on it because you can't just expect yourself to change without telling yourself that you're going to change. You, you have to take action to change. Just being like, oh, I'll change eventually. No, it takes time. It takes events. It takes effort. That is how you change. It doesn't just happen like this. You actually have to put in the effort to want to change and better yourself for the next relationship that you have. Because if you continue being the same person, then you're going to inevitably fail like every single time. You have to be better. You have to fight to be better. And when you break oh up, God, it's just an opportunity to learn. It's an opportunity for you to grow as a person. And it's an opportunity for you to find something that you did wrong and better yourself for it. <laughs> <laughs> the background. Amen, music. sister. Amen. Oh, I love the music. Oh my God, it's so crazy. Amen. Sister. Who's playing that? Who's playing that? Oh, I see. Focus. Oh my God, man. That was a whole life lesson. <laughs> that was amazing, and I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, he's not lying, though. That was I amazing, man. Oh my god, keep chatting, yo. It doesn't, it's not just coming down to relationships either. It's in work, it's in life, it's with personal relationships. When it comes down to it, you have to realize that there's only so much that you can do. And one of my favorite f quotes is there is only two things in this life that you can control. You can control your thoughts, and you can control your actions. You can do nothing about what someone does to you, but you can control your thoughts about what happened, and you can control your actions to what happened. If that means get to the gym and start fighting your demons in the gym, then do it. If that means surrounding yourself by people that love you, then surround yourself by people that love you. But do what you need to do to fight your demons and not have to worry about them in the future. Because if you hold them in and you keep that metaphorical backpack filled with rocks that is stress, and you keep adding more and more rocks into your backpack, rocks being stress, then you're going to weigh yourself down. You're not going to be able to move anywhere emotionally, physically, anything like that. You're going to fall into a rut. You're going to be in your room all day, sad, not know what to do. You have to find ways to get those rocks out of your backpack. Find ways to fight that stress. Find ways to move forward. Anything that you can do, do it. Wake up and fight to live. Don't just sit there and be sad. Do what you need to do to find a reason to live, to be happy, to enjoy yourself. Because if you sit there, nothing's gonna change. You have to put in the effort to change. You have to. So don't expect it to come to you, because it's not. You have to take those steps. And whether that, again, if you need someone to be there for you, find it. Because sometimes you can't do it on your own. People aren't like that. Humans have been since day one, packed creatures. We need other people. Even if you're the most independent person in the world, you still need other people. You can't do it on your own. You have to find someone that you can rely on. So if you don't have a best friend and you don't have someone that you can rely on, find one. Because you can't do it alone. <laughs> Not the Toy Story music. <laughs> okay, can I say something? Okay. You <laughs> got That's the music, right? No, I never. I. I Bro, I never thought I would anyway. find some, someone like you in Roblox today. Man, I gotta lie. I've been telling my bestie this shit. He's been so hey, over his Spidey, you there? And I've been like, bro. Yeah. Okay, so I know, I just want to say thank you for but, like, the lesson because like you know most life. people these days they don't they wouldn't really like give lessons. All they would do is come into Roblox, play their shit, and then just leave. I want to thank you for the lesson because you know it's just it's just like you can't find that many people today in the world. So thank you for the lesson for teaching us all of them and, of and all of this. Thank you.